Local 10 News starts right now. Well, it is graduation day for the students of Stoneman Douglas High School. Today's ceremony was spent honoring graduates while also mourning those who lost their lives on the Valentine's Day shooting. We had four seniors who were killed in that shooting. And they were among those remembered as the school continues to heal from the tragedy. Local 10 News reporter Leanne Morajon is live in Sunrise where today's graduation was held. Leanne. And Nicole and Andrew, there were certainly reasons to smile today for these students. After all, it is their graduation ceremony, but all of this happening as many of them are still coming to grips with the fact that four of their classmates were killed in a tragedy just four months ago. And we know that there were many moments that were especially poignant, particularly difficult for loved ones of those students who didn't get to walk across the stage today. Seniors at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School filing into the bb &T Center in Sunrise for their graduation Sunday afternoon. <laughs> this year's commencement, bittersweet. The class of 2018 and the community honoring the would-be graduates lost in the February 14th massacre. Nicholas Doiret, Meadow Pollock, Carmen Shentrup, and Joaquin Oliver. Accepting for Joaquin Oliver is mom Patricia. Joaquin's parents attending the graduation receiving their son's diploma, his mother wearing a shirt that said, this should be my son. <laughs> Meadow Pollock's father did not attend, but he tweeted out a picture of the great young men who were at the ceremony to receive Meadow's diploma. Accepting for Coach Aaron Feist is Coach Elliot <laughs> Staff members who didn't survive also remembered. We can love a little more. MSD drama students singing Shine, a song they created and performed countless times following the massacre. So before you go, I wanted to share a few thoughts with you, not advice necessarily, just a few things I've learned that helped me along the way. And then a surprise, tonight's show host Jimmy Fallon delivering the 2018 commencement speech. When something feels hard, remember that it gets better. In the last four months, several Stoneman Douglas students have become outspoken gun control activists. The deaths of those 17 victims in February reinvigorating the gun debate across the country. Throughout the weekend, Wear Orange events were held in several cities, including right here in South Florida. The orange representing the color hunters wear to keep themselves from getting shot. And so this ceremony was closed to the media. So much of the video that you just saw right there was provided to us by those who attended the graduation ceremony. Reporting live in Sunrise, Leanne Morejon, Local 10 News. Leanne.